they inhabited the Earth more than a million years before the dinosaurs. They exist in more varieties than any other animal group on the planet. There are 200 million of them for every one of us. They are insects. Most insects live above ground, but some live below it. They have adapted to every environment on Earth, from scorching deserts to snowy mountain slopes. Some insects even live underwater. From the tropics to the temperate zones, insects are everywhere. Yet because they're so small, they frequently go unnoticed as they go about their busy lives. In their own unobtrusive way, insects completely dominate the planet. They conquered land, water, and the air, and became perhaps the most successful animals in the history of the world. Human reactions to insects are as varied as the spectrum of insect life itself. Some we like and admire, as reflected in expressions like busy as a bee or cheerful as a cricket. Yet we find others so monstrous and repulsive that we cast them in horror movies as loathsome and despicable pests. On rare occasions, insects have even acquired a place in mythology. To the ancient Egyptians, the scarab beetle represented one of their most important gods. When it rolled a ball of dung along the ground, it reminded the Egyptians of their sun god, Ra, who rolled the sun across the sky and renewed life. Thus, the scarab beetle became sacred and even immortalized in jewelry carved from precious stones. 